Have you noticed the pattern of the types of rom-com that's been coming out? Usually the main character is super submissive. Shy, neat, otaku, hikikomori, just sits and does nothing, beta, cuck. Just the opposite of a strong main character. And who's the girl? Giga Alpha Chat. So strong, so fucking confident. We'll take the shy boy out and save him. You know why? Because this formula panders towards the exact audience. The demographic that they're selling this to. And that's us. And again, we have another anime akin to Dress Up Darling where the main character seems to be a little shy and the girl is a Giga Chad gal. This gonna be good. Let's begin today's reaction. Oh, skirt shot immediately? Okay. Duna is the prettiest girl in her class. Wow, I could never have a shot with her. And then there's me, the unpopular kid. Uh-huh. what I say? What did I say, guys? Never had a girlfriend, virgin, loser, no friend, unathletic, poor, not smart. <laughs> but she loves him. Why? I don't fucking know. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why do you care about him? <laughs> it's the delusional fantasy of these rom-coms. <laughs> it's funny to me. Oh. Oh, damn. Oh? What are we doing? Wait, wait, oh, oh. Pink. I like the turquoise blue outlines of her hair. What are we doing? Are we at her place? Huh? Oh, that's a new record. I, it doesn't get the intro scene. Our confession, the experienced you and the inexperienced me. But who is experienced and inexperienced here? Because I think there's a twist to this anime. Because, oh, there's a second, there's a second gal. But hear me out. When I was looking at the trailer, I felt, oh my God, there's three gals. I, I think Runa is actually super innocent and like she doesn't know maybe what sex is So I think that when I saw the title the experienced you and the inexperienced me You would think that he's the one that's inexperienced, but I think it's her See they're already kind of setting us up to think that Runa is like a mega whore and She just goes around fucking all these dudes, but I doubt that I doubt that He doesn't even have the main character fucking placement in the seats The main character spot is the left side by the windows See, Runa will just approach him. Why? I don't fucking know. What do you- what do you have in common? Why do you care about him? I want to understand. Look at that cleavage. Cameraman, what are you doing? There it is. Thank you, cameraman. Focus. Focus. I, I mean, she's just borrowing a pen. It's not that big a deal. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Dude, he's such a bottom. <laughs> it's over. Love that first sight. No, this is more than first sight now, but you know. Look at these sparkly lights. Bro, all, all she did was borrow a pen though. Like, okay. You should never, never misunderstand kindness for romantic interest. All she did was borrow a pencil, bro. <laughs> oh my god, bro. This one exchange of events, borrowing the pencil was what made you fall in love. I wonder if you- I don't know, maybe he should have put like a love letter in her locker. Usually the girls do that to the guys, but knowing him, I don't know, maybe it makes more sense. Yeah, get it out. Be a man. That's a good mindset to go in with, actually. You're basically going with the anticipation that it's like, ah, I'll try my best, probably not gonna work out, but still, get some closure out of it. You should've- Okay, she- He did leave her a love letter! I thought usually it's the girls that leaves a love letter for the guys, but I guess it can happen both ways, too. Look at her glowing aura. Oh my god. What is this energy? She's gonna accept. 100%. Hmm? No, right in front of me. Yeah. Yes? <laughs> yes? Will you go out with me, please? Oh. Is that a yes? Is that a yes? Mm. She is totally cute. She is omega cute. He's actually very down to earth. He knows his place, you know? Mm. <laughs> okay, me too. No, 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 ski this. My Japanese is not that bad. Maybe it is. In any other rom-com, the main character would take this opportunity to then, to then run away. But he doubled down. Thank fucking God. So... Mm. Yeah, it's a love letter. Are, are you... 
you're really cute. What's cute about me? Oh shit, I don't know. <laughs> when I, wait, that's it? It worked? Huh? Oh, okay. That, that, that was easier than I thought. No, she's gonna invite you over to her place. Okay, we're in! Remember, she dates in like two to three month cycles. I don't know why. Yeah, I, I, I didn't think it would work out, but it worked. Let's get to know each other. Uh, um, mm, uh, go over to her place. We're already walking up together? Holding hands, maybe? But there's gotta be a twist to this as to why she's so aloof and yeah. Thank you, friends. You guys are actually good friends for th making us do that. No holding hands yet? I mean, it's day one, right? It's a little awkward. I don't know. She doesn't even know how to, she doesn't even know how to read his name. Like, we're dating and she doesn't know his name. <laughs> I feel like this is so backwards. <laughs> You'll get dumped in maybe three months, but I think this one will actually stick. You, you, you asked for a pencil once. That, does that count? Mm. Uh, so, never talked before other than that small exchanges and she just says yes. What a lucky guy. Yeah, why? Does she... Is she just... I don't know if she's dumb or just airheaded, but... There's something so aloof about her, I can't really tell what it is. Uh, why? Friend zone! Uh. I mean, there's... We don't... We hardly know each other. Like, how could she possibly... Yeah, like, she doesn't even know you. Like... Like, all we know is that she's hot. That's it. But that's not love. That's lust. What? What do you like? Yeah. Look at that plushie on her bag. It's a one-eyed monster. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. You like the fact that we like you. Yes! That's exactly what's happening right now. You like him? That's kind of really easy. Wow. She's... She's... I... I I'm, yeah, yeah, but like, you don't know anything about him. The only reason that you like him is because he likes you. It seems like... It's yeah, shallow, exactly, right? It's like... I mean, you never know, right? You, you never know. So we're getting to know more about her philosophy of why she's rotating every three months, right? Interesting. This seems a little bit backwards. I feel like all those things should happen before you go out, but who am I to decide how relationships should happen? She basically just takes any chance, like, all right, let's try it out. And then if the shallow things leads to deeper interactions, then she keeps it. Okay, okay. okay. Yeah. Did you get dumped? Oh. Okay. But what happened? Why did all the guys dump her? Is this a red flag? Yeah, two to three month range. We gotta, we gotta last that long. But, but she didn't dump though. So why did they? Is she a goblet? No, no, I think all this is wrong assumptions. I think they're leading in with the fact that Gyaru gals, you know, they're like traditionally supposed to be wild and, you know, um, not like reserved. Therefore, you might think that she's a slut. No, I think it's the opposite, actually. I think she's super innocent. Oh, no, he missed the train. No! <laughs> Why did he miss the train? Oh, yeah, pretty nice house, yeah. Okay, bye, bye Oh, now we're talking. Now we're talking. Hula dance and grandma gets it. Hula dance. Mm. First day of asking her out, and we're just gonna go to her place. Okay, sure. I mean, things seems a little balls to the walls right now. Boyfriend of about like three hours, but okay, sure. Okay, sure. Maybe less than three hours actually. Probably two hours. Uh, <laughs> her room was very cute. A lot of plushies. Damn, look at the curtains. Damn, everything's so pink. God damn. Sit on our bed. Establish your dominance. That's right. Wow. <laughs> no, 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 don't. Hey, you shouldn't. She is your boyfriend. Sorry, she is your girlfriend, but I feel like we're not really there. Oh, that one looks nice, though. The black and purple. Ooh, uh, she's going to enter right now, right? 
That one looks nice. God damn, god damn. Ooh. What is the fucking troll? Maybe she'd be down to wear it for us. Y yeah. Is she just dumb? Oh, wow, wow, okay, look at this one. Will you wear that for us? Will you wear that for us? No, right now. Now. Well, even if you did, she didn't even... I don't know. Maybe she's giving us the benefit of the doubt. Maybe I'm being super mean and thinking that she's super shallow and dumb, but she's actually super genuine and authentic and she wants to believe better of other people. I don't know, man. But together? Together. Together. Showering together on the first day of going out might be one of the fastest things. What the f- <laughs> She a little stinky? <laughs> <laughs> too much sniffer right now. I'm too much sniffer. This is getting degenerate. I'm staring. I'm staring! One more. One more button. She wants to? With me? Well, again, does she even know what sex is, though? I don't think so. I think you're gonna remain a virgin because she herself doesn't know what sex means. Uh. And then this is where she says, don't boyfriend and girlfriend having sex or something? But like, does she know what that means, though? I mean, yeah, but I mean, I, I, it's, it's a little fast. I don't, I don't know. It kind of... When you lead in with a relationship with stuff like this immediately, it kind of ruins everything moving forward, if you know what I'm saying. I don't know. It feels like you rush things and it feels like... I don't know. It, everybody handles stuff differently. It's just whenever I let in with this first and then try to get to the intimate stuff, it never worked out properly. What do we... If we say no, that's like an insult to her, right? Yes, to mean something, some sort of intimacy, rather than just fucking and just, okay, that's it. I actually respect this. Some of you horny motherfuckers that are virgins are probably saying, no, why don't we have sex, please, plap, 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 but no, no, no. When you have those immediately, you'll start to realize that things feel a bit empty. And like, when stuff starts off like that, it never really ends well. You should lead in with the intimacy and then do that rather than just going like that and then going like this you want you want you want this i mean yeah I, ki 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 kind of yeah i the girl guys all dumped her but doesn't that almost sound like doesn't that sound like now she's forcing herself to like have sex immediately so that she doesn't get dumped that just feels so sad that's just so sad now out of that insecurity she's offering herself this feels weird bro Main character speech moment. Validate her right now. Tell her that she doesn't need to put out to gain love. <laughs> no, be a Giga Chad. Validate her right now. Here we go. Main character speech moment. Mm. Mm -hmm. Maybe tomorrow, but for now, tell her why it's fine. Maybe she's getting a good idea of us. She's like, oh, wow, he's different. She's so nice to the neighborly elderly people too. She's <laughs> Yeah, dude. I mean if you're a horny kid in high school and it was your chance to it kinda sucks. But still he's being very sincere. Now we're starting to understand why she might actually fall for him. This shallow interaction has turned into something deep. Huh. Oh, he's gonna get introduced to her girl group, right? She has like three different girl gals too. Oh, she's probably shocked. So many guys would probably just say, you know, if you don't put out right now, I'm gonna go fuck someone else. But he's like being so different. Okay, this is getting actually adorable. Oh my God, this is so genuine. She's gonna start crying, bro. This is a nice twist on what seemed to be like a very, I don't know, like a trashy beginning, right? This reiteration of things being shallow and deep. See, sex. When you do it with just like a random hookup, it means nothing. And eventually, you'll feel empty. But when you do it with someone that you actually have a deep relationship with, it's so much better. That's why it's better to start off with the intimacy before. This is all a dream right now, bro. Don't, don't tell me, bro. BF! Okay, GF, I see you! This is a very wholesome ending.
I don't blame him. I come on, like who's gonna not regret that? But still, good choice. Just like what she was saying about how things started off shallow and then maybe turned into something deep. This anime kind of started off shallow. Poetically, I think that's the whole point that we're trying to do. It's like, okay, and immediately, boom, you got a hot gal, brings boyfriend over, wanna have sex, and it's like, what the fuck is this anime? And then you get to actually realize why she acts like that. Because her previous exes dumped her because she wouldn't put out. And now she feels the need to do it. And everyone else is making the wrong assumption that she probably fucks like crazy and she just dumps around. She's probably a whore, but... That's the kind of reputation these kind of girl archetypes get. And I see that in a lot of anime and manga. They try to show that gals are not supposed to be these like super whores. In fact, they're just kind of, they're pretty based. They're really down to earth. They express themselves in an untraditional way. Like the culture of Japan, it kind of goes against the grain. But at the same time, they're very liberating, but also they're super hot. And that's kind of why I started watching. Anyways, I'm trying to say this anime looks promising. Very wholesome ending. Hope you guys enjoyed it. But hey, if you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.